Uh, I want to offer to you a definition or a clarification of these two powerful emotions, guilt and shame, right? Uh, shame is visible. When you're ashamed, you get red in the face. So when you're ashamed, other people see it. Furthermore, uh, to put someone to shame, you have to laugh at them. And that makes them suffer. So the essence of shame is ridicule. The other thing, guilt, <coughs> from the point of view of remembering, is the other R. Two R's, ridicule, and the other one is remorse. When you feel guilty, you feel remorse. Now, the etymology of the word remorse is that you bite yourself. Remorse. In Elizabethan English, remorse was called a game bite. In other words, you eat yourself. Related to it is the word sarcasm, which means eating flesh. When you bite someone with shame or guilt, you eat their meat. <laughs> then the question is, what is the result of having shame and having guilt? In both cases, you need a resolution. So how do you resolve shame? To have the courage to be yourself. Exactly. Right? And say, you cannot shame me because I have red hair. You cannot shame me because I am a Jew. You cannot shame me because I am a black. You have to fight shame. Now, what is the outcome of guilt? What does a person do when he feels guilty? In German, the word schul has two meanings, that you owe money and that you're guilty. Correct? Schul is a debt. So you have to pay the debt. And if you are guilty in the same in the sense of guilt, then you have to pay for it too. So what is the payment that you have to make if you're guilty? What does a criminal have to do for being a criminal? He has to pay for it. Okay. If you feel guilty, you also have to pay for it in punishment. So you punish yourself because you're guilty. See? So you have to understand that the, the, the way to resolve, to resolve guilt is first to understand if you're guilty because you did something and you have to pay for it, which is realistic guilt, or if you're guilty for neurotic reasons because somebody said that to play with yourself is a crime. That's neurotic guilt. Okay? So if you have realistic guilt, you have to make a payment. If you have neurotic guilt, like you, if you are guilty because you said to your parent, I wish you die. The parent is not going to die because they told them you die, right? So it becomes a neurotic guilt. Mm -hmm. So first of all, you have to realize that it's neurotic. And then you have to do what the priest does, but he cannot do for neurotic guilt. The priest gives you absolution if you confess a sin. If you have neurotic guilt, you have to forgive yourself. Mm -hmm. You have to really say, I, I'm guilty of that because I have this thought, and now I forgive myself and erase the guilt. That's my question. Thank you. Obrigado. Thank you so much. Thank you to you for listening. Muito obrigada. Muito obrigada.